We are working it today with Andy Challenger of Challenger Gray and Christmas here to talk about a new gender gap. Thank you for coming on the show. Thanks for having me. So this is unbelievable. The numbers are being crunched about the amount of women who are being let go from retail jobs compared to men who are being hired for retail jobs. So tell us about those numbers. Yeah, it's just such an interesting story. We know that there's been a lot of jobs lost overall in retail over the last few years as the industry pivots away from brick and mortar stores to, to uh, e-commerce. But we didn't really realize is that there's a big gender gap here. Uh, 160,000 women lost their jobs in retail mm -hmm. uh, from October to October 2016 to 17. But <laughs> Over that same time period, 100,000 men gained jobs in the same industry. So explain this. How could this possibly be happening? Because we're hearing so much about retailers cutting back, as you mentioned. Yeah, it, it is interesting, and it just shows there are certain areas of retail that are really being affected. So clothing, accessories, as department stores have been closing and shuttering jobs really at a quick pace, and those are disproportionately uh, held by women, where other areas of the company which haven't moved as much online, like vehicle parts, uh, home, deep, uh, uh, home repair mm -hmm. stores, uh, a lot of that is still being done in person. So those places are hiring right now. So if you are in the camp of, I just lost my job in retail, what do you do? Yeah, it's a, it's a difficult time. A lot of times, yeah, the uh, retail is the only job in town, uh, but a lot of those jobs are moving from the front, you know, cashiers, salespeople, to the back into warehousing, warehousing. and shipping and logistics. Uh, in a lot of ways, those areas are being underreported for retail because there's a lot of new jobs coming in those, those sections. Well, maybe the ladies can catch up there. Yeah, I hope so. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Thanks for having me.